Welcome to the Vision Edition of 2021, where we now have the opportunity to meet the management team of Crowd1 and really learn more about what is the exciting plans that lie in the future for this year. Now, it's a new year that also, of course, means a new beginning, and it's a perfect time to look at the launches, the features, and all the things that will be happening within Crowd1 during 2021. And that's also why I have invited all of the management team here today to give all of you a chance to listen to their perspectives and to the exciting future that lies ahead. So a warm welcome Thank you. to the first Thank five you. of the management team. And Yunatan, if I start with you, you're chief of expansion. And I know that 2020 was a really busy year. A lot has happened. So tell us just briefly, what does 2021 look like? It was a great year indeed, uh, but I'm pretty sure that 2021 will be an even better year. Uh, we're launching a fantastic educational tool and some really great business tools. Uh, we're also hiring some regional manners, managers and expanding to, to other regions as well to, to make sure that we're going to be busy. Busy, you're definitely going to be. And Rocky Carlson, you're new to Crowd1 and also new to our members, so warm yes. welcome. Thank you so much. I know you're on board as human resources to recruit top talent. So tell us more just briefly about that and also what is in line for 2021. Absolutely. I recently joined the company as a talent acquisition specialist or recruitment specialist, you could say as well. Um, we are growing rapidly. Mm. So my main focus for this year will be to find the top talent mm. for each position. Well, the best of luck with that. <laughs> and Sverker, it's also been a busy year for you, not least with the launch of Migster. Yes, definitely. Uh, it's been a special year for all of us. Mm. And, uh, also a very good year. Mm. Uh, we reached 100,000 customers the first mm. month with uh, oh. Migster Social. So we are all... Mm. Yeah, it's good. It's good. And I know the Mixer was really a great success. And I also heard something about Mixer Plus. So tell us a bit about yes, that. Next in the pipeline, we have Mixer Plus. Uh, if Mixer Social is for all people, mm -hmm. Mixer Plus is for the real gamers, mm. for the nerds. And uh, it's a beautiful platform. We got a presentation today and it's, it looks awesome. Exciting. And then we have Natalie, who um, I don't know if our viewers have seen you, but you are definitely the woman at the arms of the Stockholm head office, managing director of the Stockholm head office. Yes. So you're really into the daily work of what is happening in the office. So tell us a bit what is in store for 2021. Well, um, as everyone else has been saying, the whole company is growing so fast and of course also the Stockholm office. Uh, so in the Stockholm office we have gathered uh, a crew of uh, creative communication and marketing stars that are working uh, so hard mm -hmm. to deliver the right communication and information uh, in the right time to mm -hmm. the whole network. Mm -hmm. So we have busy days ahead of us and um, everyone is very excited and it's so amazing, such an amazing energy in the office. We're all looking forward to this year. Mm. I can definitely cohere to the amazing energy. I mean, yeah. there's so much busy and people are working seven days a week mm. all through the year. And Angel, you came all the way from sunny Spain and to snowy Sweden, but Thank I you. hope it's been a good travel anyway. And you're head of customer support in Spain. So tell us a bit what is in line for 2021. Uh, 2021 will um, will recruit even more uh, agents and to cover even more uh, languages. So the members will be all their answer in their own languages. It will be easier for them to understand everything. And uh, we'll try also to uh, optimize the, 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 the site so the members uh, it will be much more intuitive to connect uh, with uh, the support and uh, to have all the answers that uh, they all want uh, very fast and better. Thank you so much for sharing all of your perspectives and we can truly understand that it's an exciting and also an excelling future that we had ahead of us. So thank you for watching and we'll soon be back with five more of the management team. So welcome back to the Vision 2021 edition. I'm now here with the remaining five of the management team. A warm welcome to you all. Thank, Thank, you. You. Thank you. So, ladies first, Hannah, I'll start with you. <laughs> I know you're, I mean, you've been in every part of this business last year. So you have so much to do, but one of your main core features has been to organize um, all the mega events that we've yes. had. But they've also sort of changed format along the yeah, way. Yeah, so this year is actually going to be uh, a lot of changes. 
So we will do the mega events four times a year, mm -hmm. uh, but don't worry at home because we will have other things in between. Uh, I don't want to go into too much details today, but we will have a talk show and we'll mm -hmm. also have a lot of company information updates and product updates that are specific. So, so I'm really looking forward to this year mm. and we will tell you more uh, coming uh, weeks and months. Exciting. Yeah. And apart from sort of the business aspect, creating impact and mm. doing good is, of course, important. It's also enabled by Crowd1. We've mm. seen a lot of impact just from Crowd1 doing yeah. great work. And I know that the organization is working more and more with sustainability. So mm. tell us a bit more about that. Yeah, I think. It Year 2021 is actually going to be a full focus on sustainability for Crowd1. We've seen that we can make you know, a huge impact with mm. the crowd that we have. Mm. So we want to really take this and make sure that this is a core of our business and we lead with it and it's not an afterthought. Mm. So I'm really looking forward. We will have a new uh, sustainability strategy that will be presented also this coming weeks. Mm -hmm. And this will uh, really change also how we think in the business regarding sustainability. Exciting news. And you, one, also exciting that you transitioned um, from chief of sales to now the CEO of Crowd1. I mean, how has that been? And, um, you know, tell us a bit. It's been really good. I mean, it's uh, fantastic to take this position with all of those hardworking, brilliant people mm. in the company and also in the, uh, in the network around the world. Mm. So I think maybe a lot of members might want to know a bit, you know, the daily operations. So if you just, you know, really briefly, tell us a bit about the daily operations in the office. I must say the, the biggest changes that I have seen since I took on this role is that I have been much more involved in planning, structurizing, getting processes in place. And uh, we have been working very hard on that and have a number of very highly prioritized projects that we are running, like the sustainability mm. uh, strategy mm. that is going to be set and being rolled out for the next coming weeks and months here. Mm. Thank you. And then we have Kenny, also a familiar face. And I know we have great, exciting plans of launching Crowd1 in Dubai yes. this year. So tell us about that. It's very exciting. Dubai is an amazing hub looking at our global expansion everywhere. Mm. And first quarter this year, we're, uh, we're opening up our office there. Mm -hmm. Very big one, 550 square meters. Wow. It is to support uh, the leaders and the members around the world better. Mm -hmm. We'll also have a live meeting. So we're looking actually forward to the first live meeting in the end of February. Mm. It's actually be uh, great to see uh, people live again. Definitely. Since we've had a very successful 2020 with a lot of online. Mm. But here going back to meeting the leaders live again. Uh, it's something I look really forward to. I'm with sure. a lot of training, education. And with the hub and the office in, in Dubai, we believe we'll be able to support our members even better. Wow, exciting plans. And I'm sure all the members are really exciting to be able to have the opportunity to maybe come to Dubai. Absolutely, looking forward to meet a lot of them this, mm. this year in Dubai. Mm. It's also a fantastic place. It is. Sunny from snowy Sweden to sunny Dubai. Who wouldn't yes. change that, if not least? And Per, you've been in the business a long time and you know Crowd1 really well. And I know that you also interact with all of the leaders nearly on a daily basis. What do you look forward to in 2021? Yeah, 2021, I think, as Ken was saying, the Dubai office, meet people for real, big new, big, uh, build big new leaders mm. together with the, the team we have today. Mm. And uh, oh, the most thing they're looking forward to is to meet people for real now, mm. not, not, not on, the, on the internet. Mm. That is such an opportunity with 2021, definitely. And last but not least, we have Martin, and you ha also have a really important role as you're sort of part of Crowd1's legal and compliance team. And looking at you know 2021, what do you think will be the biggest challenge especially with the expansion and the growth of Crowd1 when it comes to the legal and compliance perspective. In 2020, we experienced spectacular growth, all hands on deck. Um, we set up a legal and compliance team. We had to invest in corporate affairs. There were authorities who were doubting our integrity, so we had to guard our integrity. Mm. Uh, compliance software, um, policies and procedures, we had to do a lot. Mm. And 2021, Crowd1 will be 100% compliant all over the world. 
that is quite an achievement. So 2021 really does start off on a great start with legal and compliance, not least, with exciting new formats when it comes to talk shows and conferences with a new CEO in position, a launch in Dubai, and the leaders in place. It can't get any better with, than that. So thank you for watching. We'll soon be back with the founder of Crowd1. Stay tuned. Welcome back. Now, 2020 has been an unprecedented year in so many ways and has also affected us in many ways. It's been challenges, opportunities, new ways of living, working and socializing. It's also been a year of digital transformation that not least has catapulted Crowd1 in an accelerating pace and today has achieved the momentum of more than 20 million members. And that is quite an achievement. And now I'm going to talk more about this and the plans for 2021 with a familiar face, Crowd1's founder, Jonas Erik Werner. A warm welcome. Thank you very much. So 2020 has passed. We're now into 2021. Do you mm -hmm. have any New Year's resolutions that you bring into the new year? Yeah, first of all, I, I think I, I will try to to uh, wa take some walk in the nature because I, I've been behind the office 24-7 uh, mm. in 2020. So, so uh, yeah, <laughs> go outside a little bit more. And see the world from <laughs> yeah, another that's perspective. A goal. Yeah. But also, like I mentioned, I mean, it's been an unprecedented year, but it's also been, however, a really fantastic and transformational year for Crowd1, um, much due to the pandemic and the sort of digitalization mm -hmm. that that implies. What has been the highlight of the year in your eyes? First of all, we, we were very well prepared mm -hmm. uh, when we started the company. And I'm really glad for that today because, of course, we didn't know that the world should change as it did in 2020. But the highlights is probably, uh, first of all, how we manage to, to change our concept and, and in a really fast way and become uh, not only a, a mobile online company that, that to become the next generation mobile online company. Uh, and uh, all the members around the world know that, that we, in the beginning, did, uh, did the live events and stuff, but we went over, we had to go over to, to online, 100% mm. uh, online. Mm. Other great achievements is, of course, that we managed to launch everything that we had planned to launch. Mm. Uh, and, of course, the, the, the growth of the company. Mm. Um, it feels a little bit like a dream sometimes, mm. going from, from a million members, which was a, a great achievement, and we were so happy, and then go up and, and uh, become more than 20 million mm. within a year. Uh, a year that is, is uh, totally different from all other years uh, that I have been mm. uh, in my life. So, so yeah, it, it has been a great year. Mm. You no, know, it's definitely a remarkable journey. And I mean, Crowd1 has changed the online business without a shadow of a doubt. And also, I mean, you must be the fastest growing crowd networking company in, I mean, in the world at the moment. Yeah. And, and with that growth, what do you think has sort of catapulted that growth? And how do you think that growth will continue in 2021? When we started the company, a big thing uh, was to, to create a business for all the, all the billions of people around the globe that actually very soon spend the same amount of time mm. on their mobile phones as they spend on their regular job mm. without earning anything. Mm. So, so the goal was to, to give all those hundreds of millions of people a business mm. uh, and a business that everybody can do. Mm. If you are young, old, man or woman, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter where you live. Mm. It doesn't matter if you have or don't have knowledge from before about, about uh, uh, any industries mm. because we are the five minute business. Uh, and the five minutes business is something really powerful. That's the only thing you need, uh, five minutes to, to duplicate the business. So, so I must say that um, that is the biggest reason for sure that we have a concept that all people can do around the world. 
And I mean, growth is amazing, and that's always what a company wants, but it also brings a lot, you know, challenges as well, that kind of scalability and all of that. So could you just, are there any challenges that you could sort of convey, and, and how do you see the solutions to them? As I've been saying over and over, uh, we weren't expected, no, nobody was expecting uh, what should happen in mm. 2020. Uh, uh, and uh, of course, that, that created a lot of challenges mm. for all companies in the world, millions of companies, including us. Uh, and when you have uh, members in, in more than 100 different countries, um, different regulations, uh, different ways of handling things, you're working with a lot of banks, institutions, and so on. Uh, it, ha it would have been strange if we didn't have uh, big challenges. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, but we have been able to solve most of them. One thing that was a, a bigger, uh, we had to work much more with, was uh, the payment systems. Mm. Because uh, my dream, and, and the dream for the company, and I have been in this industry for a very long time, and my goal is to, is to give all the people not only the chance to, to, to earn money mm. on, on the largest movement in the history, mm. but also be able to do it very quickly. Uh, because our business is not only changing people's lives, it's also changing uh, the, way, the way to live day by day. And uh, after this year, most people know that, that um, it, it is really good uh, to have a second income, mm. uh, an online income, when you can't reach your regular job. Uh, but we had to work really hard to be able to do payments. And, and the last six months, we had some delays in the payments. Uh, but because that we were so well prepared uh, with the company, we could put a lot of effort and focus on, on, uh, on uh, update our system mm. and create new solutions uh, to be able to handle this. So uh, in the end of the year, uh, I know that, that a lot of, lot of people, a lot of members, a lot of leaders have seen that we have been speeding up uh, the, our systems a lot. And uh, now uh, in 2021, I'm really glad to say that we have uh, implemented mm -hmm. uh, a lot of a lot of uh, technical solutions, mm -hmm. helping us to be able. Uh, we have scaled up the system a lot, so so we can we will be able to have a totally new payment system uh, that will will. Uh, change everything. Mm. Uh, I think I can say that we probably have the best uh, payment system uh, in the world. Mm. I mean, we have more members than a lot of countries mm. uh, have, have um, people. So, mm. so um, yeah, uh, 2021 will be the year when we not only change this industry, mm. we will also change uh, the speed and, and the way to, to do uh, payments mm. uh, that people can have when they need them mm. quickly. Mm. Sounds really exciting. Yeah, it's also been tough. <laughs> also know that Martin mentioned that when it comes to legal and compliance, that will also be 100%. Yes, of course, that's, that's also really important, uh, important because, I mean, just being in a lot of countries is a big challenge mm. in itself. Mm. If, you, if you add on the, the world situation, of course, and you add on the, the exploding growth that we have been having, uh, you have a little bit like the perfect storm. Mm. Uh, so, so I'm really happy that we have gathered a lot of people into the company with a lot of knowledge mm. from international business, not only crowd marketing, but, but, uh, but um, from different areas that have, and this have helped us uh, to become ready uh, for 2021 and to be able to deliver uh, fast and, and uh, secure system mm. to do global payments. Mm. But it has been sweaty, I mm -hmm. promise. And uh, I'm so glad that, that all our members around the world have uh, trusted us, mm. that we will be able to solve this. Mm. Uh, I have been in this industry for many years mm. and I know how important it is when you are building a business, you put a lot of effort in it and, and you spend many hours, a lot of people spend many hours a week 
Uh, and I respect that job. I coming from that industry myself. Mm. So I know how important it is to get the payments in time. Mm. Uh, so my only promise uh, to all the people around the world is, is that we have systems in place. So we will not only beat records in the industry in growth, we will also try to beat records in, in uh, how to, to be able to do global payments with mm. really high speed. Wow, thank you for clarifying that. So t taking that in place and looking at a lot of the features and products and launches that will be happening in 2021, tell us more about that. Yes, uh, I mean, I, I hope a lot that the world will open up a little bit. It will be easier for, for all people around the globe to to, to have a better life mm -hmm. again and, and to, to be able to do uh, a better business. Mm. Uh, but we don't know what will happen, but it doesn't really matter for us because the businesses we have prepared are our online mobile businesses. And uh, uh, beginning of 2020, I was really happy because we had solutions and products and services that I couldn't even imagine that we should have. But that is actually nothing compared to what we will do in 2021. Mm. We have prepared for a very long time. Mm. Uh, the Mixture Plus uh, that a lot of people probably know about, where we take the next step further into mobile gaming. Mm. Uh, uh, it's a big thing uh, and it will be a, a perfect product for, for hundreds of millions of people around the globe. I mean, there are billions of people uh, doing on mobile gaming every day. Mm. Uh, and we also take the step into entertainment and communication. Mm. And um, that was also a dream uh, for me to be able to, to uh, build uh, crowd marketing in, in uh, industries that people love. Mm. I mean, if you love something, uh, you like to do it, you don't need to teach people about things that most people love and do every day. So that will be fun. But also, uh, we will uh, go into to the largest, one of the largest movements, and that's, that's uh, the crypto world. Mm. Uh, the next, the next, uh, way for people to to do business with each other so we will we will also go into the crypto world with crypto services to all our members and um yeah that's a that's a big thing and and um uh i love i love that world mm. uh i can stop smiling when i think about what we will be able to deliver to uh, to all our millions of people um around the globe in mm. 2021 it will uh, it will be exciting it will definitely be exciting it sounds like a transformative year and you also have expansion plans to dubai mm -hmm. not least you're launching yeah. in dubai in february any more expansion plans in the yeah we, we 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 want to be uh, be uh, close to to members even that we are uh, working with with online business mm -hmm. i think it's important uh to to be uh, close uh, and to have the the live feeling i think that even that the world have changed so most things are done online uh, a good business should start with a handshake mm -hmm. and and we want to to come as close as we can to mm -hmm. a physical handshake with our members mm -hmm. so so we are planning uh, to uh, between five to ten new offices around the world mm -hmm. to cover mm -hmm. south america to cover even more the African continent, uh, Asia and, and Europe, of mm. course. Uh, so Dubai uh, is a big thing and it will be a perfect place, as Kenneth, Kenneth said, uh, where we can uh, take in networkers, mm. uh, the members, the leaders from all around the world. Mm. Uh, but that's only the beginning. Mm. Uh, we will open more, more, uh, more offices around the world. So, so looking at the accelerating rate of everything that will happen just in 2021, just to summarize today, what do you envision 2025? That's only five years from now. Where is Crowd1 then? Most people mm. in the world have a mobile phone. A lot of people don't even have clean water, mm. but most people have a mobile phone. So I believe to be able to change the world, we need to use the tools that most people have. Mm. What we want to do 
mm. is to create the business for all, all people, mm. all people in the world. And I, I know that that's a big vision, mm. but I think it's doable. Mm. And we will start with 50 and go to 100 and go to 200 mm. and 500 to a billion. Mm. But I believe so strong that, that um, it's time for a company to, to give all members, all, all, all people around the world, a chance to get apart from the, from the biggest movement in the history. I mean, it's not the, the internet world and the mobile world and the way we communicate, the way we'll do, we will do business in the future should not be for only a couple of companies, large corporations. We need to, with, with millions of needles, do holes in this bubble mm. and let it rain down to, to all people around the world. And um, we have just started the journey, but in, in five years from now, um, in 2025, 2030, we, um, we will be uh, billions of people mm. in crowd one, mm. for sure. Mm. And something that I, I also need to clarify and, and to address mm. is of course that, that uh, nothing uh, would have been uh, possible Without, to do without all the, all the leaders and all the members around the globe. Mm. And, and uh, I, I couldn't even believe, I mean, I've been in this industry for many years, but, but something happened when, when, there is, when there is problem in the world and we have a global lockdown, people step up. Mm. And, and the leadership that I have seen in this company, and I, I've seen thousands of members with, uh, without knowledge of this industry, take the next step and become leaders. And, and not only leaders that think building a business, they use the business to help other people, mm. to help the community. Mm. And, and, uh, and uh, so, so to answer again on one of the first questions of, of the highlights uh, of this year is probably also to see how people how people change and how people how people start to to think bigger and bigger, and and to be a part of that is is, is um, yeah one of the biggest experience I have been having in my life and and we will as a company embrace this and 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 work with it mm -hmm. and and make sure that we become better and better to to um, to support and help all the members. And, uh, and this, is, this is a thing that, that, that the team in the company that we have mm -hmm. are, are really into this. And, and on the meetings we have, more morning meetings on the different offices around the world is always really fun to be on because there is also this, always discussions how we can make it easier mm -hmm. uh, for, for the members because I'm, I'm really grateful for, for all the members and, and um, all you around the world should actually know that we, we, will, we will work day and night until we have the most streamlined business and the most smooth business to be able to support uh, all the members mm -hmm. in all countries. And there's a lot of things that, that we have in plans with, with more languages in place. And yeah, it's, it's a lot. I, I, I really love, I could talk for hours about this, but we, we, we will really, 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 really work hard to, yeah. to, to match the energy that we get from the members mm. and, and, and from, from from everybody mm. that really love to do this business mm. and and so together with the members uh, we are we are a team and and we will yeah we will work together and mm. and, and make make magic happen make magic yes. and truly living up to the motto impossible is nothing yeah yeah it is yeah <laughs> Jonas, Erik Vanne, thank you for being such a visionary leader and also to your team. I mean, it's amazing to follow the company and I'm sure all of the members as well. This must be exciting. We've talk and talked to you and the management team and this was just an icing on the cake of everything that is in line in 2021. And not only is it the management, but of course, all of you members around the world who are contributing to the success and achievements of Crowd1. So with that, stay tuned, stay safe and healthy and see you soon.